Cyrus kind of loves it. Um, he seems beleaguered at times, but I think he loves dealing with about four, put, trying to put out four fires at a time. Is he ready for the first lady? It seems like everybody is caught off guard by her mission as the end of last The first lady is formidable. And Cyrus may have met his match. the sixth out of the first seven that goes back to the campaign and we realize Melly is capable of going to some amazing lengths strategically and with the press and shocking all of us she's a wild card she's a wild card she goes rogue and uh, and so you know Cyrus is kind of fully warned but to be warned about something that's unpredictable is still to be kind of scared. So, yeah. It seems like Cyrus, as much as he's a strategist, was still kind of caught off guard by, like, Billy and the Vice um, President's aide and then the First Lady. How is he being blindsided by all these internal problems? Is he just so focused on what's going on outside that he's not aware? I think it was a, yeah, and I, well, and I think it was a pretty full play. He assumed could be a regime-ending sex scandal. Um, did not imagine for quite a while that that was perpetrated elsewhere. And only, only Billy. Uh, those, um, you know, only when Billy Chambers came forward did all of us realize, you know, uh, that it wasn't who we thought it was. Yeah. 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 So I don't know if it makes, yeah, I don't know if it makes Cyrus look a little bit clumsy strategically or hopefully, I think in the writing, it's kind of. Particularly amazingly evil. Evis and devious. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Those were some brilliant story plot lines that just came out, and you're like, oh my god, we never saw that coming. <laughs> I know. It was fun. <laughs> I know. I think Shonda right, is so that she and the staff are so gifted with this cliffhanger changes of gears and plot lines. They're just so much fun. Well, yeah. it's been awesome watching it play out. We'll be looking forward to what Cyrus does now. I'm glad. Thank you.